fuel filter replacement in a Volkswagen Caddy. This is the two liter model and this is a 2012 is the year. So it's T20s here. One, two, three, four, five. We want to lift all those up. There's an area here where you push in a flat screwdriver to crack the seal and then it'll be just using something like a cable tie or a hook to hook it up out of position. I now have the top of the housing removed. As you can see here, the rubber seal is right there. What I always do is make sure you clean all the way around that and up underneath here so that there's no dirt that when you're trying to reseat it down here that it becomes uneven. So I've cleaned around all that and all up there as well. The fuel filter is down there. I'm just gonna use a hook to pull that up out of position, change the rubber seal, and then it'll be fit down the new one. So just confirm that the filter is the correct type. As you can see there, what I've done here is I've just caught the fuel into a can as it was coming out, so it wouldn't be spilling all around the place. I've also replaced this rubber seal, which is in the housing already. I'm just gonna fit this into the can now. So as you can see there, that is the seal that has been replaced. And when I was removing the old one, I just had a, a, a can <coughs> set up here that I could put it straight into so I wouldn't put diesel all around the place. Okay, so we have everything tightened up and all back together. The only things of note with these is when you're tightening them back down to make sure that you go crossways and do an even pull down. You don't want to tighten up one side where it can bend and unshape this area here. Um, also, when you're removing, when you pop that, lift it up, you want to go around, especially if it's in there a long time, and pop it from the back as well as the front so you don't bend it if one side is stuck up here. And that is pretty much it. The only difficulty I've ever seen with these sucking in air is when um, the actual top housing bit has been bent from, from either force lifting it up or not put back down right. I'm going to start this engine up now and this job is then complete. 